joining me again. I'm Stacey Baker with EXP Realty, and we're going over the benefits of home ownership. We're on number three, which is probably the toughest one. Um, home values have a well-documented history of going up over time. This increase becomes equity, which is our next segment, and you can benefit it from when you refinance or you sell your home, right? Correct? So let's look at appreciation. If you have a house that's older, like let's say 1940s, 1950s, if you don't maintain it, it can fall apart. That's depreciation. So it's going down in value because you're not maintaining and taking care of it. Appreciation is keeping your house at a really good level of maintenance and keeping it up with the neighborhood, right? Um, you might need to remodel it. You might add on a sunroom. You might add on a pool. Um, and that can actually increase the value of your home. That's kind of like a forced appreciation, we call it. Now, there is depreciation, which is like, you know, the rundown houses that are falling apart. Like out in the south, you can actually see like houses falling apart. There's not very many in California, for sure. Um, but land doesn't depreciate. So let's say you wanted to invest in a piece of land. That's great. It's not going to go down. It's going to stay pretty stable unless, right, something moves in, like an airport or a school or a subdivision or business development park, industrial park. If something moves next to it, then your land appreciates in value because you actually have value added from what is growing around that piece of land. So you can have forced appreciation in your home, right, by remodeling and taking care of it. Or you can have just the regular appreciation of just taking care of it and maintaining it. That is something about home ownership that you can't find anywhere else, right? Literally during the pandemic, houses went up 1% in equity a month. So think about 10 to 12% of if you bought a home in 2020, it went up 10%. So if you bought like a $500,000 house, right? That's 50,000 in equity that you gained in appreciation because of the market. And there are some areas of California, right? That are super hot, that there always will be a high demand like Beverly Hills and uh, Palisades and Torrance and Oh, things in OC, Newport Beach, you know, uh, Malibu, something that's very prestigious will always keep their value and go up because there's more demand than there is actual houses. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you on the next segment. You can call me, you can email me, or you can text me if you have any questions. Thanks again and have a great day. Take care. Bye.